Hey guys, how are you? So today I will be doing a tutorial on custom schedules which can help in a lot of the ways with custom hourly, daily, monthly prices and it's actually pretty easy for you guys to do. So first off open your pterodactyl panel and normally you just press here on the schedules tab and here you can see create new schedule now as a schedule name I will just add diamond and you can choose the time I'll just put every two minutes and you can choose the hour so how many hours hours and days and week so I'll create a schedule and now we as you can see we have the new schedule here and we can press on it and we'll see this so now we can add new tasks or just simply edit this again let's add a new task and as you can see we have actions now we have send a command send a power action which can start, start start the server restart stop or terminate then you can even create a backup and just choose ignored files can choose offset time but I will just stick to the send the command for now here you'll just on the payload you'll enter the command you want without the slash as it will be using the console to send it now just press you can add more I just recommend one at once one command per task you can do more it's totally possible and shouldn't be any problems as long as it's correct. I use the star because I'm using Essentials X, but would for you guys if no Essentials X or an odd plugin would just be like this for everyone. Nearest player, random player, self. I'll just stick to this. Now press on create task. Now you can still edit the task, add new things, but that's basically it. It will happen like two every two minutes or the time you've chosen. You can either now delete, edit, or do things you've done before, even add new tasks. But if you want to test it directly, just press here on run now. It says processing, and if you check in game, you receive a diamond. And that's actually everything I have to show you today. It's pretty easy, simple, and somehow efficient, I would say. You can customize it a lot, add custom things. Let's say I want to change this and add an iron ingot. Let's say the changes. It's still processing, it might take a while until it refreshes. Let's check the console and see if it did happen. You can see it did send as a console. And yeah, that's basically it. Hope you like it and yeah, see you next time.